Hello everyone. My name is Ulga Arslan and I am one of the 15 early stage researchers as part of European Organ on Chip Consortium. I work at Leiden University Medical Center under the supervision of Professor Dr. Christine Momory and Dr. Valeria Orlova. Today, I would like to introduce my PhD project to you. Development of Mini Heart on Chip for Personalized Medicine. But first, let's quickly go through a very hot topic in the regenerative medicine, stem cells. What are stem cells and why are they important? Stem cells are unspecialized cells of the body with unlimited proliferation capacity via cell division. So these cells can renew themselves. Moreover, stem cells can become any type of specialized cells in the body, such as heart cells, with the help of genetic clues which activate or inhibit genetic components. After many key developments in stem cell fields, today, scientists can also reprogram many cell types back into stem cells. For example, by simply getting a skin biopsy from an adult arm and activate genes to direct these cells into stem cell fate. In this way, we can generate stem cells easily and differentiate them into cell type of interest, which in my case is heart cells. But before programming stem cells to become heart cells, let's first discuss the heart. Our heart is a very complex organ with multiple cell types. Cardiomyocytes are the beating part of myocardium, and the telial cells cover the inner layer of blood vessels. Cardiac fibroblasts are the tissue formation unit of the heart, and macrophages are components of the immune system. To date, cardiovascular disorders are the leading cause of death globally. Animal models have been used extensively to understand the disease mechanism and develop drugs. However, although these drugs work in animals, there are only few drugs that actually improve the quality of life for human patients. And this is where my project comes into the picture. Our goal here is to develop a multicellular model to capture physiological and pathological responses of the heart. In order to reach this goal, there are a few steps I will take. First, I will differentiate stem cells into different cellular subsets of the heart using previously established protocols by our lab. Then, I will integrate these cells to form beating mini hearts, which will later on be integrated into a chip where we can apply physiological flow. This heart on chip model offers an alternative to animal studies and it will open up a new era for a potential pharmacological setting in disease modeling and drug screening. With this video, I summarize the key points of my project and what my plans are. Thank you for watching.